Okay, so let's see if you have enough math knowledge and skills to figure this problem out. This is not that difficult, and if you can't solve this problem right now, no worries, in a couple minutes you'll be an expert. But uh, here is the question. We want to find the angles of this triangle. Okay, so this angle in the triangle is x degrees. This angle right here is 2x degrees, and this angle right here is 3x degrees. What are the actual angles? Okay, so that is the question. Feel free to use a calculator. But uh, if you can figure this out, go ahead and put your answer into the comment section. I'll share the correct answer in just one second, and then I'm going to show you exactly how easy it is to solve this problem. But uh, before we get started, let me quickly introduce myself. My name is John, and I have been teaching middle and high school math for decades. And it really is my true passion to try to make learning math as easy as possible. So if you need assistance in mathematics, check out my math help program at tcmathacademy.com. You can find a link to that in the description below. And if this video helps you out, or if you just enjoy this content, make sure to like and subscribe, as that definitely helps me out. Okay, so we're looking for three angles, this one, this one, and this one. What are the angles? Well, let's go ahead and take a look at the answer. Uh, the actual answer is 30 degrees, 60 degrees, and 90 degrees. That is it. Uh, this is not a difficult problem. But uh, some of you might be kind of sad. You'd be like, well, if it's not that difficult. I don't know enough math to solve this basic math problem. Well, you should never feel bad about something you don't know. And it's totally okay to make mistakes in math. But what we want to do is have you looking like this, like the person that got this right. So if you figure this out, uh, let's go and give you a nice A+, plus, a 100%, and multiple stars. So you can brag to your friends and family that indeed you are a certified professional expert in solving geometry problems about triangles with algebra. Now, if you tell that to your friends and family, they're going to be like, uh, yeah, that's nice. I'm going to go back and watch Netflix, enjoy your math. But uh, in all actuality, if you figure this out, that is very good, especially if you've been away from math for some period of time. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into the solution here. And again, if you didn't figure this out, this is quite easy, but we need to know something about triangles. We need to know something about the angles in any triangle. And here we have no information other than this is a triangle. And uh, of course, these degrees have these relationships. So this one here is the smallest angle, right? It's x degrees. This one is twice this, um, the smallest. So this is 2x degrees. And then this, is, uh, this angle here is three times the smallest or 3x degrees. So how can we approach the solution to um, this problem? Well, the only way we can solve this problem is we need to know about angles in a triangle, and this is what we need to know. And uh, this is one of the kind of uh, number one things that if you're studying uh, geometry or if you want to know, if you want to know one thing about a triangle, this is the one thing that you want to know. There's a lot of properties about triangles, but everybody should know this uh, property, and that is the sum of the uh, sum of the angles in a triangle always equal. 180 degrees. So what does that mean? Well, if I take this angle, and it doesn't make a difference uh, what triangle we're talking about. You take this angle plus this angle plus this angle, you'll always get 180 degrees. So the sum of the angles in a triangle equal 180 degrees. Now, if you're saying to yourself, oh, okay, that's a nice hint, Mr. YouTube Math Man. I can figure this thing out. And you're like, well, we'll put that knowledge to work if you forgot that the sum of the angles uh, of a triangle equal 180 degrees because all we could do here, or all we have to do, is take this angle plus this angle plus this angle and have that equal to 180 degrees, and that's going to look like an algebra equation. So indeed, we have to use our friend algebra to solve this equation. All right, so this is what we have here. We have this angle, x, plus this angle, 2x, plus this angle, 3x, is equal to 180 degrees. We don't need to write that uh, degree symbol in here because it's just assumed that uh, we are dealing with degrees. All right, so at this point, what we have to do now is solve this equation. So indeed, you have to have some basic algebra skills. So let's go ahead and see if you can solve this basic equation. This is not that difficult. So let's go ahead and take the next step, which of course is having you subscribe to my YouTube channel. 
Now, I wouldn't stop this lovely math video uh, unless if, you know, if it wasn't that important for me to interrupt <laughs> our little learning session here. Uh, you know, for what I do on YouTube, um, I put a lot of effort into YouTube because I'm passionate, again, about helping people learn math. But I do need your support by you subscribing. Okay, it really does help that YouTube al algorithm uh, uh, reach more people. I'm trying to reach as many people as possible, particularly these people that are frustrated in math and they're like, I don't like math. The reason why people don't like math is because typically they don't understand math. Now, some people just don't like math because they're just not into it, and that's perfectly fine. But uh, here's the deal. If you're frustrated math because you don't understand math, well, you know, I am trying to help you. Now, if you're not getting adequate instruction in your class from your teacher, well, then I would like to be your teacher. Matter of fact, right now, as I'm um, doing this video, I have like 510,000 subscribers, which is crazy. But I look at every subscriber, honestly, as a student. So by you subscribing, it really does help me reach people like yourself uh, that might be interested in math or need help in math. Thank you so much. And by the way, if, if you're going to subscribe, hit that notification bell as well so you can get my latest videos. All right, so let's get back to this problem. And this is going to be quite easy because I know you are an expert in algebra. Okay, now if you are taking some sort of geometry course, typically you'll take uh, a, a full geometry course after at least one year of algebra. You have to have some basic algebra skills uh, to solve most geometry problems. Okay, so what are we going to do here? Well, we have 1x, uh, two, this is 1x, right, Pl uh, plus 2x, plus 3x. So all of these are like terms. So this is going to be 1 plus 2 plus 3. And the last, last time I checked, that is 6. So that's going to be 6x is equal to 180. So to solve for x, all we have to do is divide both sides of the equation by 6. So x is equal to 30. Now, a lot of students, they'll get so excited and be like, look at me. I am so wonderful in math. I'm going to get an A+. Plus. And uh, this has happened many, many times throughout, uh, or many, many uh, times throughout many, many years of teaching that students will have done everything perfectly and they'll be like, I'm done, here's my answer, x is 30 because they're focused on solving the equation, but you forgot to answer the question, okay? So what does this mean? Well, we have x is equal to 30, but we have to go back to our diagram here. So x is equal to 30, and that basically means that this angle here is 30 degrees, but we need the other angles. So we're gonna have to go back and now that we know that x is equal to 30 degrees, we can simply plug this in right here. So this would be 2x or 2 times 30, which of course is 60 or 60 degrees. And over here we have to go 3 times 30. Of course, x is 30, and that is 90 degrees. So, you know, a lot of uh, students, it's, you know, and I made these mistakes as well. Everybody makes mistakes when you're learning. But, it, you know, to be successful in math, you have to stay focused, all right? Even though you're so enthusiastic about learning and doing well, you know, if you don't concentrate, all right, uh, you, all that hard work will go to waste because I want you to get full credit. I want you to ace your math courses so you can look like this person every single time. Okay, now if you need more help in geometry uh, or in mathematics, algebra, whatever the case is, check out my uh, uh, different math courses. I'm going to leave links to my primary math courses uh, in the description of this video. Currently, um, uh, there's probably a few days left on a sale that I'm running a 50% off sale on my primary courses. This is a sale that I run once in a blue moon, uh, maybe once a year at most. But uh, if you need full instruction, you really need uh, a lot of support, these are the courses that you want to check out. This is my best full comprehensive work. But if you just want to check out other videos, again, I have a ton of videos. As a matter of fact, right now I have over 2,000 plus uh, videos on my YouTube channel from basic math to advanced math, not calculus, and everything in between. Okay, so with all that being said, I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematics adventures. Thank you for your time and have a great day.